G'day blindies. Well, it's Thursday night and the blind man's in Perth. We told you the blind carnage tour was going to go off. And, well, in 24-hour period, 6,000 kilometres, four states, 24 hours. I can't do much better than that unless they give me a space shuttle. And even then I'm going to see how fast I can go and probably crash. But thanks to DJ and uh, Automotive Carnage, because... Blind Graves and Automated Carnage have teamed up for the Blind Carnage tour. They've provided me with this wicked apartment for the night, well, for the next two nights, actually. And um, I think it's only fitting I give you a bit of a tour around. You'll have to excuse me because I am a little bit under the weather. I've had a couple of drinks with my nephew and his mate because they're looking after me to make sure that I don't fall out and break my leg and there's no one to help me or anything like that. So let's go for a tour. So, there's a bag there, I won't step on that. That's a wall. <laughs> Over here's our kitchen area. We've got alcohol on that, as per rules. Then we go over here. Look, we got a fridge. Like, I was, I was gonna be a street kid if Don let me, but he wouldn't let me. So now, there's our door. We got a bathroom. Down here in here. I think this is my bedroom. Is it? Bathroom, shower. This is a shower. Whoa. This room seems like, listen to the echo in here. Must be a good size. I gotta have party showers. <laughs> All right. They gotta turn the lights on because I don't even know that they're on. Oh, there we go, now we go around here. Now this is my room. All right. Look at that. Flash or what, guys? So, thanks to DJ and the Automated Carnage um, crew, the blind man's living at Biggie in Western Australia. Hang on, we've, got we've got a balcony out here. here. Look, this is the lounge room. Let's see if I can get across here without... I mean, Epi's guiding me so I don't run into crap. Curtain. Curtain, do I? woo we're out on the balcony. That's the pole. There we go, railing. How cool is this joint, guys? Like, cool. the blind man was going to be a street kid if they let him, but DJ wouldn't wear it, neither would the automotive carnage crew. So they put me in these mad digs. Like, we got the TV going. I know it's going because I can hear it, but it's no good to me because I can't see it. But got to entertain the boys somehow. We got Adam Sandler. On. Adam Sandler? Yeah. He rocks, man. Yeah. All right. I'm trying to make my way back to the table. Yeah. Got it. All right. Now we're sitting back down. So you've done a tour of the Bly Man's digs for the next two nights, thanks to the DJ. And we're just going to kick it here tonight and have some fun with my nephews, listen to some music, watch some TV, maybe knock out a couple more videos. But at this point in time, massive thank you to the Automotive Carnage crew for hooking the blind out, blind man up with some mad digs. And we're doing it, DJ. Cool, bro. Now, from here, I rest up till Saturday morning. Then I'm on a train to Kalgoorlie. And then I meet the infamous DJ. And hopefully he's there to pick me up. If not, I'm just going to wander around Kalgoorlie like a lost street kid. And then we're off to Lavington and he's going to... Got lots of crazy things happening that I can't disclose yet because you will have to watch, tune in and see where we go, what I do. No. Guaranteed I'm going to get in trouble. But before I do go, I'll introduce you to my nephew and his mate. This is my nephew, Shaney. How's it going, guys? Nice to meet you all. And Callum, isn't it? Caleb. Caleb, Caleb sorry. Caleb. Caleb. And... They're babysitting me for the night so I don't fall off the veranda or go walk about in Perth and get lost with the three kids. <laughs> so, we'll leave it there and we might do another one later on. Thanks, Automated Carnage. I'm living like a king. Anyway, guys, keep your tyres turning for Tilly. Cheers. Stop recording.